It's Friday! You're watching the Biggest Beauty Project, and I'm vlogging from a car again. Go figure. Alright, so this week we are talking about five things that melt our heart. Um, you guys sure know how to confuse a new girl because two of you did one thing and then two of you did another thing. So, I've decided I'm going to do six things. I can't hold my other hand up. Six things, and I'm going to do three of each. Three things that melt my heart about men, and then three things that just melt my heart in general. So, I hope that's okay. Anyways, first, I guess I'll do the three things that, I mean, if you're a guy and you're watching this and you want to get with this, I mean, you better, wait, what is it? Now, here's a story from A to Z. You want to get with me, you got to listen carefully. Number one, the first thing is hold my hand. Um, I don't care if we're driving in the car and you just reach over and hold my hand, or if we're like walking somewhere and you hold my hand, or if we're just sitting on the couch watching a movie and you want to hold my hand. Hold my hand. It's so freaking cute and I love it to death. The second one has got to be, um, call me a cute name that is not stupid, like babe, baby, hot stuff. Don't, I don't want to be called that. Um, my boyfriend calls me, um, it varies from day to day. He'll call me beautiful, which is, oh, so freaking cute. And then he'll call me sweet pea, which, um, I like both of them. They're really cute, and it just melts my little cold heart when he calls me those. And then number three, um, be funny. I love a guy that can make me laugh. Um, not afraid to be stupid. If you say something stupid, I'll probably think it's funny, and I'll be laughing about it for days and days and days. So, I like someone that can keep me laughing. Okay, number four, which this is not going to have anything to do with ways to get with me, so guys, you can quit watching right now. Um, animals, especially my little kitty. I have the biggest soft spot for animals. I love every kind of animal. It doesn't matter. It could be... I, I have rats. I own rats, if that tells you anything, and I love them to death. So just any kind of animal, squishy and fluffy and cute. Yeah. <laughs> Okay, number five is going to be a band. Um, I'd get my phone out so I can show you. I'll turn down the radio. Any song by this band, I swear, this oh, makes me feel so good inside. What one should I play? Maybe one that nobody's going to really know. Because they have a couple songs that are popular. But then they have some that nobody at all knows. I'll skip some of it. Step on it. Say a prayer. Baby, talk to God. He is there. And if you don't know who they are, I'll play one that everybody's going to know. Okay, <laughs> so, yeah, pretty much any song by Lady Antebellum, I adore, adore, adore. I can listen to it over and over and over, and I guess I'm saying my words in threes, 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 but yeah, I love Lady Antebellum. Okay, number six is, it's going to have to be babies. I don't have any babies. I do want, I want a lot, a lot, a lot, a lot of babies, but like the cute, like little fat, chunky ones. Oh, and when they just learn to talk, and my boss's daughter, actually, she is, I want to say she's 16, 17 months old, something like that. So she's a year. I, I know moms like to do it by the month, but whatever. 
um, I, I love her to death. I call her my little chunky monkey because she is like just the chunkiest little thing ever since she was born. And um, I actually taught her to say duh. And my boss probably hates me because she'll walk around and she'll be like duh, duh, duh. So it's so cute. So I love babies. There's a creepy old man that I can see in my mirror that's creeping me out. How <laughs> my doors are locked. Alright, so those are six things that melt my heart. Um, this is a good topic. I thought it was really cute. I liked it. And I loved watching everyone else's videos. Um, I love that everyone got the Spice Girl reference like right away and just kind of rolled with it. I thought that was funny. I used to have a Spice Girl club in third grade, just so everybody knows. And I was Baby Spice. And we would go around the playground and sing and kick boys and stuff. It was great. Um, so, anyway, what are six things, or I guess five since that's the original. What are five things that make your heart melt? Tell me down below. And I hope you guys have an amazing week. And I'll see you on Friday.